The first module is Contract Lifecycle Management. Initiation. Contract initiation in the solution can happen from multiple intake channels, such as a provider filling forms on a portal, a provider sending applications via email or mail, calling customer service, or a health plan representative filling forms. Provider Search. The solution enables the author to search for the required provider within the health plan's internal database, such as a claim solution or external databases like CAQH, and then add them to the contract. If provider information cannot be pulled from any of the databases, the author indexes the information manually. Generate a draft contract. The solution provides the relevant pre-approved templates which will be used to generate the draft contract. It collects information around provider, vendor, compensation, and contract terms. The solution is designed to capture multiple tax IDs, multiple office site addresses, multiple providers, and multiple products in the same contract. The author uses the preview feature to make additional edits before generating the draft contract. Amend draft contract. Based on provider's specific requirements, the author can modify clauses or languages or terms. Based on the template selected, the solution limits what can be modified and to what extent. All the modifications are redlined for tracking purposes. Collaborate. Next, the author collaborates internally to amend the modified clause and language level approvals. Predefined workflows send the draft contract to concern department for approval in parallel. Once the draft contract is approved at all levels, it is sent to the provider for negotiation. Negotiate. Built-in email or print and mail functionality can be used to send the draft contract to the provider. Any changes to the draft contract by the provider are tracked automatically within the document. Accept changes. After receiving the draft contract, the author accepts or rejects the changes prior to generating the final contract. Finalize contract. The final contract is then sent for internal review and approval within the solution.